Matt's making his 12th start of the season. He has a team leading six wins as he takes the mound today against the Astros. He's making his second career start versus Houston. The other one coming last month. That was down in Minute Maid Park. He earned that win, but he only threw five innings and gave up eight hits against the Astros. Altuve having a good series, four for seven in the Astros' first venture up to Buffalo. It's the one-two, and Altuve drills this one deep down the left field line. Ball is hooking. Gurriel is back, looking up, and that ball is gone. A leadoff home run for Jose Altuve, and the Astros have a one-to-nothing lead. His fifth leadoff home run of the season, and his 19th of his career. Mats will throw off speed early in counts, but he tried to sneak that cheese on the inside corner. And Jose Altuve here with this one o'clock start in Buffalo, up and ready to turn on it. And a big celebration from Garrett Stubbs in the dugout. A little tapper, gloved by Mats as he makes the toss to first to get Carlos for the first out of the inning. Well, Mats now with two outs after the home run by Altuve will face Jordan Alvarez. And he goes the other way this time. It won't be a home run, but that'll be a little base hit to left field for Jordan. So he'll be a two out base runner. Astros' second hit of the game. Guriel coiled as he waits the payoff pitch. And it's high, ball four. So the Astros have two on with two out for Kyle Tucker. First and second, two outs, a man in. And there's a ground ball. Nice play by Bichette. He spins and fires, and Stephen Matz is out of it. And they are set to look at Luis Garcia for the first time. Another very good right arm from that Houston farm system. Luis Garcia is 4-0 with a 157 ERA in his last four starts. He threw a career-high seven innings of one-run ball in his last start. That was against the Red Sox. He's got a 260 ERA through his first 10 career starts, which is the seventh lowest in Astros history. The 0-1. That's a ground ball hit up the middle. Altuve to the left of second fields and throws to first in time. And two out, no one on for the designated hitter, Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Garcia's 1-2. Swing and a miss. Got him on the cutter. And that's the first strikeout for Luis Garcia. Completes a 1-2-3 inning. And after one in Buffalo, Astros won, Blue Jays nothing. McCormick getting the start in center field today. Miles Straw not in the lineup. There's a ball drilled to left field. All the way back goes Gurriel looking up. Gone home run. The Jasmanian Devil hits his fifth home run of the year. And the Astros lead this game two to nothing. Well, apparently the Astros are going to lead off every inning with the homer. They got the memo. <laughs> McCormick got the memo with the wind blowing out to, to center field today. Get the ball in the air. And McCormick put a great pass on it. Kind of fits the idea of a Jasmanian Devil just turning him on a fastball. Yeah, there you go. Jones starting at first today with Guriel DHing. He's 5 for 29 as a big leaguer, 172 average, no homers, three driven in. Here's a 1 1. And Jones hits it pretty well toward right center field, headed toward the gap, and that's going to split the gap and one hop the wall. And Jones on his way to second base. He'll stop there with a double. Hernandez at third, panic at first, one out for Lourdes Gurriel Jr., left fielder. He's been swinging the bat much better of late, his average up to 262. There's a drive, that's going to get caught out in the outfield by McCormick and tagging at third and coming in is Teoscar Hernandez and the Blue Jays have cut into that lead. It's now 2-1 to Houston. Astros looking to capitalize on a nobody out bases loaded situation. Tucker, who has hit lefties pretty well throughout his career at 209 this year against left hand pitching. First pitch to Tucker, a big breaking ball, is hit to shallow left center field, and that's a base hit. Bregman will score. The Astros are going to send Alvarez. Here's a play at the plate. He's safe. Tucker drives in two. The Astros lead four to one. Great job by Jordan to read this base hit off the bat of Kyle Tucker. Here's the 3 2 pitch to Simeon. It's a shot up the middle, backhanded by Altuve. He goes to third. Bregman tags him out. What a play by the Astros infielders. Altuve's momentum took him that way, and a bullet throw to Bregman, who was just getting over there in time. Great heads up play by Jose Altuve. That ball was smoked up the middle by Simeon. It's just a heads up play by the Astros. Told you they're the finest fielding team in the American League. They've only committed 21 errors, the fewest in the American League. Danny Jansen exits the ball game with a right hamstring strain. And as you mentioned, Reese McGuire now in the ball game. 
on the ground right side diving stop by Altuve what an inning defensively for Jose he gets Bo Bichette on a great defensive play for out number two full out dive to get that ground ball Bichette making a bid going the other way Altuve diving into that shallow right field area comes up firing great play Astros lead by three with two men on Telez grounded out his last time up big left-handed hitter Garcia set here's the pitch breaking ball got him strike three as he snuck that slider low and in and Telez swings right over the top five strikeouts now for Garcia and he escapes trouble McGuire hitting 231 in 16 games 286 on base percentage no homers in an RBI for McGuire who started last night the 0-1 and that's lifted in the air to the left side over toward the line. Alvarez in foul territory makes the catch and then bangs into the wall. Nicely done by Jordan staying with that. Not a whole lot of foul territory deep down the left field line at Salem Field. And Alvarez had to use all of it to come up with the ball. Another opportunity to beat that runner. And the 1 2 to Altuve and he hits it in the air to left. Guriel coming in, still coming in and makes the sliding catch. Maldonado back to second. And that is the first out. Boy, he barely got to that one. A late jump. He was fooled by the swing of Altuve. The Oscar Hernandez, the batter. He singled and scored in the second, struck out in the fourth. Here comes the kick and the 2-2. Swing and a miss. There was a really good cutter. Darting down out of the zone. And that's seven strikeouts for Luis Garcia. Two away. Randall Gritchuk will take his turn. 0 for 1. A strikeout and a walk. Strike three call on the outside corner. Gritchuk thought it was ball four, but he goes down looking. That's the eighth strikeout for Garcia. Inning over. So Maldonado to the plate now hit his second career grand slam on Friday night. Cued off the end of the bat. That'll be bouncing away from Telez. Maldonado still out at first base. Didn't get down the line, and that cost the Astros a run. Hold the phone, though. Yeah, take a look at that. You're the Astros. Boy, a ton of English on that ball he is safe indeed. So the call on the field is over chair. Here's Guriel. He's reached all four times. Two walks, two singles. Astros lead it 5-1. to 1-1 one. One, one to Guriel. And that's hit hard. And in the left field for a base hit. That'll score Bregman. And the Astros lead is 6-1. to one. Yuli, his third hit today. And his 41st RBI of the year. He's reached all five times in this ball game. Guriel. And the grounder off the end of the bat. Altuve quickly to second for one, and that's all they'll get. So Guerrero's retired at second. A run comes in to score. Randall has walked and struck out twice. As a base hit up the middle, that'll mark home Bo Bichette. As the Blue Jays are scratching and clawing here in the eighth. And now. You get into the, the meat of the Blue Jays' order, starting with Marcus Simeon. A uh, one-two. And that's a ground ball left side, charging Bregman, picks it off to his left, throws to first, and that is the ball game. The Houston Astros take two out of three in Buffalo from the Blue Jays.